nobody does a team up like Spider-Man. And while it's not hard to imagine him teamed up with Black Widow and Ant-Man, have you ever heard of the wall crawler teaming up with the supervillain Swarm and Yellow Jacket? When Strike needed a stealth expert that could keep up with the best and worst the multiverse has to offer, a particular version of the friendly neighborhood Spider-Man came to mind. After losing his job as a photographer, Peter Parker took on a new role as a research scientist and engineer at Horizon Labs, a high-tech research and development company. Soon after starting, a new hobgoblin broke into Horizon Labs to steal a synthetic vibranium. Spider-Man was no match for this hobgoblin and his supersonic scream weapon, resulting in hobgoblin escaping with the vibranium. <laughs> used his Horizon Labs resources to develop new technologies to help him fight Hobgoblin and other threats as Spider-Man, including a new suit. This new suit, often referred to by fans as Spider-Man's big time suit, had two different modes. A green camo mode, which gave him the ability to be invisible to both visual and audio means. And a second red anti-sound mode that canceled out all Sonic-based attacks. With his upgraded suit, Spider-Man swung into action, defeating Hobgoblin and recovering the stolen synthetic vibranium. Now, thanks to the interdimensional threats posed by common foes, another Peter Parker joins forces with some unexpected infiltrators to form a new team in Marvel Strike Force. If you're interested in the other spider people that Strike has recruited, maybe check out some of our other videos. Gwen, Spider-Punk, Miles, and more have all made their way to Marvel Strike Force. <laughs>